I welcome all of you in the lesson number 10 for grade one, grade two mathematics. What we did uh, yesterday, guys, we started uh, from practice zone of the book, which is related to the number pattern. We learned about number pattern, how we can identify the number pattern and then how we can write the missing numbers. So question number one was about what number comes next in each number pattern. And we had to describe the number pattern as well. So when we look at A, 33, 35, 37, 39, so we identified that we are counting in twos here. So uh, after 39, we again count two and we get the uh, other number that was 41. And in the pattern we write, uh, we write that we are counting in twos or we are adding two. Same we did for B. When we check the pattern 16 plus what will give us 19. So that is three. That's mean we are adding three here. 19 plus 322, 22 plus 325 and 25 plus three is 28. So we uh, identified the pattern and find out the missing number. What was the pattern here? We were counting in threes here or we were adding three. So we wrote, we wrote here counting in threes or adding three. The C is 84, 82, 80, or 78. We identified this pattern also that from 84 to 82, we are not adding something. Why? Because 84 is a bigger number and 82 is a smaller. 82 is less than 84. 82 is less than 84. That means we are not adding. We are counting back or we are subtracting. Okay. For how much we are counting back? We are counting back if we uh, check one time 84, we go back one time 83, two time 82. So we were counting back here in twos. So 84, 82, 80, 78. So same we applied here after 78, we go back two times or we minus two, that was 76. And in the pattern we write counting back in twos, subtracting two. The D was 20, 25, 30, 35. So when we look at this pattern, so we check that number is in increasing order. Second number is greater than first number. That means we are adding some number. For finding out what number we are adding, we check. So we are not adding one here, two, three, no. Actually, we are adding five here because after 20, we get 25, then 30, then 35. So we add five in 35 and we write 40 here. And in the describing the pattern, we write this is counting in fives. Same we did for E. Here in the E pattern, this was 69, 65, and 61. So we identified that this is not an increasing order. This is the decreasing order. 65 is less than 69. Whenever we have second number less than first number, that's mean we are not adding. We are subtracting. We are not counting. We are counting back. Okay. Now we have to find how much we are going back. If we go one, back, one time back, it will become 68. Two times back, 67. Three times back, 66. So we are going four times back because when we go four times back, we reach 65. From 65, four times back, 61, 57. Same we applied on 57. When we go four times back, count four times back, we get 53. So the pattern was counting back in fours or subtracting four. In the F, that was very easy. This is also not an increasing order. This is also in decreasing order. We see 100 is greater than 90 and 90 is greater than 80. That's mean we are subtracting less, less and less. Largest to smallest we are going. So 100 minus what will give us 90? So we find out that 100 minus 10 will give us 90. 90 minus 10, 80. 80 minus 10, 70. So 70 minus 10 will be 60. And we wrote here the pattern that we were counting back in tens. And that was subtracting 10. Okay. Do you have any issue regarding this exercise up to from A to F, guys? Yeah. Do you have any yes. problems, any question? <laughs> if you did not understand anything from question A to F, you can ask message on the chat box and I can open your mic and I can tell you the answer. I can make you understand again, no problem. If you did not get anything 
from question number one. You can send message on the chat box and I will make you understand again. So no message in the chat box. So open your book uh, page number 119 then. We will start question number two. We will start question number two. In question number two, guys, this is very easy. What we have to do, we just have to complete the pattern. We just have to identify the pattern and write the missing number. Saud. Okay, let, uh, let me open your mic, Saud. I will ask you what you did not understand. Yes, Saud. Sir, I mean, I understand. You understand? I mean, no, sir, I, I don't understand. Understand. I understand. You understand? You don't have question? Yes. Okay. All right, guys. So we have to complete the number pattern here. 5, 10, and after 10, what will be the number? So guys, tell me your answers, please. Complete the pattern. 5, 10, dash, 20, dash. Okay. I am receiving an, uh, Muhammad al sagir Very good. Muhammad Faro, Adam Khalid. Muhammad Al Harbi, Muhammad uh, Farooq, Adam Khalid, Saud, Omar Hassan, yes, Sharif. Tell me the answer, Sharif. This is the pattern you write just. Okay. Muhammad Al Harbi. Muhammad Al Harbi, tell me the answer of A, 2A, not B. Omar Hassan. Very good. Ayan, very good. Other students, please. I will check your names. Who is not answering? Uh, Ayman, Ayan, Abdul Rahman, Ali Nizar, Arsh, Khalid. And Muhammad Al Neil, Mantar, Zaid Al Walid. I want answer from your side also, guys. That's why. Yes, Khalid. No, it's not sixteen. Why sixteen? Check the pattern. Check five, then ten. Then after ten, what should be? So guys, this the easy way. You, you check the first number is 5, the second number is 10. So it's confirmed that this is an increasing order. You are counting. You are adding something, not subtracting. Why? Because 10 is greater than 5. So you add something in 5, that's why it is 10. Okay. Now how much you add? You have to find out this. 5 plus 1 is 6. 5 plus 2 is 7. 5 plus 3 is 8. 5 plus 4 is 9. 5 plus 5 is 10. This means you are adding 5. You are counting in 5s. When you identified the pattern, then you can easily find out the next value. Apply the pattern in the 10 and find the next answer. The right one is the answer. Okay, I'm going to open someone's mic and Majidavad. Majid, can you hear me? Majidavad, can you hear me? Please open your mic. Yeah, sir. Yes, after 10, can you tell me what number should be there? 15. Why? Yes. 15 after 10. Why 15? Can you tell More. me? Can you tell me why 15? More 5. We are because we are we are counting in fives, right? 5. We are counting More in fives. More 5. More five, very good. 
Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, guys. So he has told me that after 10, we, I should write 15. Why should I write 15? Because he said we are counting in fives. Now let's check one more student, what he will say after 20, what should I write? Uh, Suleiman Sole. Yes, sir. Can yes. you tell me after 20, what number should be there? Um, after 20? Yes. After 20? Yes. 25. Why twenty five? Um. Um. Because we're counting in five. Very good. Very good. Very good answer. Thank you. So, guys, he said the answer is twenty five because we are counting in fives. So this is the answer, guys. We are counting in fives. Five plus five ten. Ten plus five fifteen. Fifteen plus five twenty. And twenty plus five twenty five. So we are actually adding in fives or counting in fives. So I'm going to write the answer. This is 25. This is the answer, guys. 25. Now we, I will ask for the pattern B. Pattern B, 10, 20, 30, and then next. So guys, you have to answer. 10, 20, 30, what's, what will be next? Omar, very good. Adam Khalid, very good. Khalid Abdullah, very good. Omar Hassan, very good. No, Elias, after 30. 20 is already written here. After 30, what will, become, what will come next? Saud, Ayan, Ahmad Yusuf, very good. Mantar, very good. Arsh, very good. Saud, very good. Muhammad Farooq, very good. And Rafiq, very good. Ahmad, Muhammad Al Rufai, why thirty three? Check the pattern again. 10, then 20, then 30. After 30, what should be the next? Check the difference. 10 plus what will give you 20? 20 plus what will give you 30? Then you will identify the pattern. Okay, Mantar, I will ask you, no problem. Uh, Mantar, where is he? Yes, Mantar. Yes. Okay. Very good. Can you tell me answer? After 30, what the question is? 14. 14. You mean this? 14. 14. No, no. 40, 40. 40. You mean this? 40. Yes, this. Why 40? Tell me. Because ending and tens. Because we are counting in tens. Okay. Thank you. He's saying because we are counting in tens. He said 40. Uh, let me take one more student. Uh, Zed. Can you hear me, Zed? Zed, can you hear me? Open your mic, please. Zed. Can you hear me, Zed? Okay, he's not answering. 
Muhammad. I will take him. Muhammad, can you hear me? Open your mic, please. Muhammad. Muhammad. Uh, uh, Dr. Hajir Hussain, please rename it. Whatever uh, your name is, please use your name. Okay, go to your setting, go to the setting, edit it and rename it. I will take one more student guys to answer it. Suleiman, can you hear me? Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Yes, Suleiman, can yes. you tell me after 60, what number should be there? 70. Okay, why 70? Counting in tens. Very good. We are counting in tens. That's very good answers. So guys, this is 70. Thank you. Why this is 70, guys? Because we are counting in tens. First, when you look the pattern, you check this is an increasing order because uh, this is going from smallest to largest. 20 is greater than 10. 30 is greater than 20. That means you are adding. Now you will find out how much you are adding. 10 plus what will give you 20? So 10 plus 10 will give you 20. So that's me, you are counting in tens. After 30, you add 10, it becomes 40. And here after 60, you add 10 and you find out the next number. This is 70. Very good, guys. Okay, uh, Sharif, uh, I want to give chance to other students also. Yesterday, I asked you a question. That's why today uh, I'm going to give chance to other students, okay? Because uh, we are mostly taking the answers in the chat box. We are not asking uh, individually to everyone because we cannot ask everyone. So I will take only five to 10 students today. Otherwise, I will take your answers in the chat box. And I recommend all of the students to answer in the chat box so that I can see whether you can answer or not. This is part C, guys. Question number 2C. 48 dash. 40, 36, 32, 28. Guys, before answering it, you have to check the pattern. It might be difficult for you. If you look the pattern carefully, don't answer it right now until I explain. If you check, this is the missing number. This is the number you don't know. Okay? Leave about this. Check these two numbers. Check from here to there. These are the four numbers. Identify the pattern from these four numbers. Then you will be able to know that what the pattern is. What I will do, I will see first the pattern is in increasing order or in decreasing order. This is 40 and this is 36. So which number is greater guys? 36 is greater or 40 is greater? Tell me. 40, 40. 40, Very good. 40, 40. Is, 40 is greater. That's mean 46 is a smaller number. That's mean we are adding in this pattern or subtracting. Yes, guys. Are we adding in this pattern or subtracting? Very good. We are subtracting. Now we have to check how much we are subtracting. Subtracting. Very good. We are subtracting. Now we have to check how much we are subtracting. For that, what we will do, we will write here 40 and we will check. If we go one time back from 40, if we go one time back, this 39. Two times back, 38. Three times back, 37. And four times back, it is 36. So guys, I found out that I am going four times back. I am counting back four times to reach 36. That's mean I am subtracting four. 40 to 36, 39, 38, 37, and 36. Counting in fours. I will check this for 
another number also 36 go back one time 35 two time 34 three time 33 and four time 32 now i am sure that i am counting back here in fours in this pattern we are counting back in fours is it clear guys that we are counting back in fours in this pattern Yes. 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 Very good. Now you identified the pattern, so you can tell the answer easily. This is 48. You have to minus 4. You have to subtract 4. You have to count back in 4s. So now tell me your answers in the chat box. After 48, what number should be there? Ahmad Yusuf. Very good. Muhammad Farooq. Very good. Muhammad Al Harbi, very good. Khalid Abdullah, very good. Sharif, very good. All students need to participate, guys. Muhammad Asad, very good. Mantar, very good. Ayan, very good. Ayad and Muhammad Al Sagir. Your answer is wrong. Why 42? Subtract 4 from 48. You identified the pattern. We are counting back in 4s or subtracting 4. Subtract 4 from 48. It will not be 42. Omar Hassan, very good. Ahmad Yusuf, very good. Okay, Sharif. Muhammad Al Sagir. Arsh. Ilyas. Let me take Iyad with me. He is continuously giving me wrong answers. Where is he? Ayat, can you hear me? Ayat, can you hear me? Yes. Ayat, are you using two IDs to attend the class? What? Are you using two IDs to attend the class? You are entered in the classroom with two devices? I, I can see two Ayad here. Okay. Joseph and Ayad Shami. Okay, Ayad, okay. tell me. So write your proper name, full name, okay? In the uh, name. Ayad, tell me, me one thing. Yes. Ayad, what number should be there after 48? Where? 48? Mm -hmm. oh, hello, one minute, sir. Yes, we identified 94. the pattern here. Sorry. 94. Why 94? Look at the pattern. We are going from smallest to largest or largest to smallest. Tell me first this, first, first thing. Uh, Look, 40 or 36. 40 or 36. 36 is smaller than 40 or greater than? 40 is big, I see him. That means 36 is smaller, right? Yes. 32 is smaller than 36 or greater than? Uh, 36 is big. Big. That means from left to right, we are subtracting, right? Not adding. Yes. If we add, then this number should be bigger. After 40, it should be bigger. Bigger than 40, right? But it is a smaller. Yes. That means we are subtracting. That is fine? Fine. Now, you have to check from 40, how much you subtract to get 36. Check, count back from 40 and check how many times you go back, you count back to reach 36. What? A uh, 40? From 40, yes. Count back. One time count back. Before 40, what comes? Before 40, what comes in counting? In counting, if you find out before 40, what number comes? Uh, 40. 
After which number the forty comes? This is forty. What? Forty, forty-one. Before forty. Forty-one. No, before. I am not asking after. Before forty, what number should be there? Wait. Uh, uh, sir, thirty, thirty. Why thirty? Count back only 13. one time. One time. Count back one time. One time. Yes. Start counting from thirty. Thirty. Thirty, thirty-one, like this. Thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-five. After thirty-five, nine, thirty-nine. Okay, very good. You go back one time. It is thirty-nine. Go back one more time. Two times from forty. Go back two times. Before thirty-nine, what comes? Forty-nine, forty, thirty-eight. Or uh, before thirty-nine, down. down, down. We are counting back, subtracting. One time you count back thirty-nine. Two time you count back thirty eight. Count back three times. Thirty. Before thirty eight, yes. Thirty eight. Thirty seven. Thirty seven. Very good. And it is thirty six. Go back one more time. Three, three time you go back, you find thirty seven. Now go back four time. Like one time you go go back more before thirty seven. You go come? back for uh, four time. No, only one time go back now from thirty seven before thirty seven. What comes? Thirty uh, six. Thirty six. Look here now, Ayad. Okay. You you one. were at forty. Okay. You go back one time. It was thirty nine. You go back two time. It was thirty eight. To reach thirty-six, you go back how many times? One, two, three, and four. How many times you go back? My number four, yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. How many times yeah. you go back? How many times you go back? Uh, four or one? Uh, four times. Okay. Four. Four times you go back. Four times. That's me. Yeah. You minus four from forty. Forty minus four equals to thirty-six. Same here. If you go back from thirty-six, if you go back four times, you will find thirty-two. One time thirty-five, two time thirty-four, three time thirty-three, and four time thirty-two. Right? Thirty-one. Now you have to find out this missing number. Go back four times from forty-eight and find the answer. Subtract four. What? Uh, From forty-eight, go back four times I and tell me the answer. Yes. From forty-eight, I go two times or what? Four times, because this is the same pattern. In the whole pattern, you are going back four times, right? I got uh, four times. Yes. Back. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, forty-eight, uh, forty-seven. First, when you go one time back, forty-seven. Not start from forty-eight, okay? Okay. Hmm. Loudly, loudly. I want to hear. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, forty-eight. Hmm. Forty-seven. Mm -hmm. Forty-six. Mm -hmm. Forty-five. Mm -hmm. Forty-four. What is the answer here? What should I write here? Forty-four. Very good. After twenty-eight, tell me what number should I write here? Forty-eight. Uh, okay. Uh, ninety-two. Why ninety-two? Uh, Go back four times. Twenty-six. Why twenty-six? No, 
Check it carefully, then tell me no, the no, answer. No, no, not, uh, not uh, 26. 20, hmm. uh, 29. 29. Go back, Ayad. You see the pattern? We are going back, okay? We are subtracting, going back. Go back four <clears throat> times from 28 also. Okay. So uh, 28, 27, 25, uh, no, 26, 25, 24. Yes, what 20, is the answer? 24. 24. Very good. Yad, you, uh, you yes. were not attending my previous classes? Uh, Listen to me carefully, okay? You have, you need to do practice for the patterns. We have done too many practice for the patterns. Even you are struggling. Okay, guys. Uh, guys, do you have any problem in this question? No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. Okay, can you tell me after 48 what number should be there? Very good. It is 44. So you will write here 